26 hours since the sentience landed in Sector 1215. And so far, they have not attempted to exit the remains of their vessel. I say remains, because their landing was either not executed adequately, or this vessel lacked significant maneuvering capability. The visible portions of the vessel have suffered catastrophic structural damage during the violent landing experience. I have detected atmospheric leaks in 17 distinct locations along the hull. My analysis shows that the mixture of gases coming from the ship matches the natural atmosphere on my installation almost exactly. Perhaps the occupants, if they're still there, were originally cataloged here. Perhaps these beings will confirm that the plan was successful and that the galaxy has returned to its proper cadence. I am beyond optimistic. But I do not understand why these sentients have not attempted to exit their vessel. Other than the leaking atmosphere, the only thing emanating from this wreckage is an automated distress call. I am currently translating this automated broadcast, but with such a limited data set and no direct communication, I do not anticipate full comprehension. Given the short-range nature of this craft, it is likely that other vessels are nearby. But, in accordance with procedure, I am blocking the distress call. No communication of the location of any installation is permissible. I admit great curiosity about these visitors. While the plan is quite clear about procedure for this situation, I have my doubts. How many failure points can the plan sustain before blind adherence becomes counterproductive? Surely in light of all that has changed, I should be able to modify my responses to adapt to them. No. I have duties. And I have a terrible cargo here. I must be sure. I shall obey and content myself to monitor. I hope they go out soon, though. So many questions to ask. So many questions!